the new A-Class with the door cladding removed. Naturally, you can also remove the door module. Begin with the ceiling strip, which you simply pull out. Then remove the rubber covers on both openings. These are for the fastening screws for the window. Now you need the door cladding again, because it contains the switches for the window controls. Plug in the connectors and move the window's fastening screws into the position in which you can access them. Unscrew the screws two rotations in order to unfasten the window. You do not have to unscrew them completely. Tip the rear of the window upward and pull the glass out of the window slot. Then disconnect the battery. Then remove the grommet on the door and unscrew the screw for the door handle. Then remove the locking cylinder on the door handle and unplug the electric connection. Then remove the entire door handle. including both seals. Then unscrew two more screws. Unplug the connectors on the control unit with the help of a plastic wedge, for example. There are three screws on the door lock, which you unscrew. Now the door module is only held by rivets. Use a 7mm bit to drill out the rivet heads. Success! Simply remove the door module. After this, you need a release tool. Use this to press the remains of the rivets out of the holes in the door. As there will be metal shavings on the inside of the door panel, you need to vacuum the panel. And this is the door module with the cable for the electric windows and the locking system. Refit in the reverse order. But now, we will take a look at the riveting tool. You use this to punch the rivets back into the holes. When replacing the window, please note that you must first place the window on the mountings and then push it into the rear window guide seal. Then fasten the window again. Then the door module is back in its place.